Hello students, welcome to Veranda IS. From the current affairs of environment in this session, we are going to learn about three branded rose finch. The learning objectives of this particular session will be to discuss three branded rose finch, explain the reason three branded rose finch being in news, then discuss the growing list of birds in India and then describe state of India's bird in 2020. Let's begin first by introducing ourselves to the three branded three banded rose finch. The three banded rose finch is a transient in Bhutan and a resident of southern China. Transient here means that it is for some time it comes into the Bhutan and permanently it is a resident of southern China that means it is found over there. So that is the simple meaning of that. So the unusual species of bird was discovered and photographed in Arunachal Pradesh by a team of scientists from Bombay Natural History Society BNHS. So, discovered in Arunachal Pradesh. So, that is the point for the prelims examination again. Remember that. Then further, the three-banded rose finch is a seed-eating. So, that is important point. Seed-eating passerine bird with a notably conical bill that belongs to finger LD family. So, that is the information, brief information about this particular breed or particular species of uh, bird. There were 1,339 avian species, that means there are 1,339 bird species recorded from across the India, so that is a significant number, prior to the addition of three branded rose finch to the country's bird list. So, this is the uh, reason also as to why it is in news and all those things. So, simply this bird was added in the list of birds that are there or they are visible in India or they come to India for a certain period of time. So, further, why it was in news? So, in April 2021, the three banded rose finch of Arunachal Pradesh has been added to India's bird list as the 1340th species. The Bombay Natural History Society team discovered it near Sela Pass. Again, this is from geography's point of view important. Sela Pass on the border of Arunachal Pradesh, Tawang, and Western Kameng districts. So, it is Sela Pass lies in Arunachal Pradesh in between. Tawang and the West Kaming district. So, remember that this is just the picture of how the bird looks like. So, this is three banded rose finch. So, that was the news and because of that news it is important one. So, the, remember it has 1340 species of the bird in India. So, that is a significant number. Now, the another point is to discuss about the growing list of birds which is actually a good thing when it comes to bio biodiversity in India. According to the release, India has 1340 species and with the advent of technology and dedicated bird birders reaching inaccessible locations, several species are documented each year. So, it is contribution of like what you can say the technologies and even the people who are interested into birds watching and bird sightings. So, they every now and then they sight new kind of birds. So, again with the cameras and every other technological advance, it, it has been made possible that we are able to document this list of uh, birds and all. So, that is the first point. Then, since 2016, India's bird list has grown to include 104 new species. So, that is the positive thing when it comes to the biodiversity of India. So, remember these things again for the prelims. Five new species including three branded rose finch were added to the list in 2021. So, that is another point. So, further, what is the state of India's bird according to the 2020 report? So, the state of India's bird 2020 report was released at the 13th conference of parties of convention that is on the conservation of migratory species of wild animals. Like birds are migratory in nature, so that's why they come into that category. Now, the report, basically this report, the state of India's bird report categorized 101 species of birds in India as high concern, that is they are vulnerable and they need to, protection is need, uh, needed to be taken, 319 moderate concern and 442 as the low concern. Remember this. So, significantly we can say that 442 birds are low concern, 101 species of birds of high concern. So, the efforts needs to be taken to conservation of this and 319 moderate concern. So, efforts are again needed so that they do not become con of high concern. Now, the following was found in the report. Further, the population, the important point and UPSC has also asked a question on this as to why it is decreasing. So, the population of Indian vultures has plummeted dramatically. That means it has reduced dramatically. Now, the reasons for that is the use of diclofenac 
and all those chemicals which are there for the cattle and all those things. So once they uh, we are we are using those uh, those medicines in the cattle. So what we know vultures feed on the dead bodies and all. So that is entering into the vultures and that has impacted the bodies. And even urbanization is responsible for the decline of vultures in India. Further, the Indian peacock in it is a national bird also. So the country's national bird has seen a tremendous growth in recent decades. Now the reason for this is that in earlier cases poaching was very much prevalent. We all know that peacocks feeders uh, people used to keep in their books and all those things. But when we are keeping that we have to remember that it is outcome of a poaching of a bird. So the penalties for poaching peacocks under schedule one of the wildlife act are largely to blame to the increase in the population. So if we can say rather than blame it is the positive sign that we can see that the number of peacocks in India is increasing. So that is a good thing. So rather than saying it blaming it the efforts have been concentrated in right direction. So poaching has been reduced in the when it comes to the Indian peacock. Now to summarize what we have learnt. We have learnt the three banded rose finch. We studied the reason three banded rose finch being in use because it has been added into a list of 1340 species of avian uh, or avian species that has been added in the list of birds in India. Then we saw the growing list of the birds it is significantly increasing that is a good sign and then we studied the state of India's report in 2020. So with that I hope you have understood this very very small topic about three banded rose finch why it was there. So that's it for this session see you in another one. Thank you.